everyone, and welcome back to the World Gauntlet. Uh, I forgot, well, I didn't forget. It just took longer to upload yesterday because I had to do some editing because I didn't get the song within one second. So uh, it recognized it as a song that was copyrighted, copywritten, whatever the word may be. So I had to edit that out. But the video is up from yesterday, so enjoy that. Um, today I am joined by Carol Burnett from The Carol Burnett Show. Uh, hello. It's a comedy from a long time ago. Interesting. It's what apparently was on my mind at the moment. Um, you could have just said half the tur half the skirt of the Squirtle Squad, if I could talk. No. Weird. Uh, R has to be the second letter. Yeah. I mean, unless it was like Forte, but there's no, there's no O, yeah. yeah. Uh, huh. Uh, what the fuck? Okay, yeah. Uh, okay. Um, what the f what? hello it's not bright I did that um, right right none of those make sense trite what the hell is a trite someone can be trite okay yeah that's one of one I saw this picture I had no idea what it was um, I see. Um, is it? It's a little grainy for me. Is this more beachy, or are we more so in like an Arizona? -y I think Arizona. -y. I have. I actually have a thought now. Um, there's a, definitely uh, a part where he or she is in one of these in a in the desert in Mister and Mrs. Smith, and they like shoot at. They try to get that kid. I, I forget. It's been a while, but. Um, I do not have an additional guess. Um, there's like Rimmers. a there's like a campfire here, a lookout. I don't know what's going on back here. Maybe like a gallows, the boarded up shack. Uh, tsh. yeah. I better take a shot in the dark. Okay. Uh, this is Logan. <laughs> that was yeah. pretty easy. Okay. Because they they try to make this fucking uh, Cadillac look like futuristic and it looks fucking stupid. Um, I have not seen this movie. I've only, uh, 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 other than the initial time I've seen it, I should say, but, uh, yeah, I've seen it. Yeah. Fire. Just once. Yeah. Uh, two of two. Fire. I don't know from that. Fucking the song. hate the blues. Um, I don't know the song, but it sounds like a blues song. It just sounded like it was gonna go dum to 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 dum to. That's a new one. Okay, so you just told me it wasn't going to do the thing that it, it did exactly. Dun, 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 dun. The fucking every blues song. I hate the fucking blues. I'm really bad with names. But I don't. I have no this idea. This dude just died. Just died? Like when? Yeah. Like within like the last year or two. Uh, uh. What else does he sing? What are some of the lyrics to the song? It just sounds like a fucking song that fucking Elvis Presley did. Mm. Like forever ago. I guess. I don't know. 50s? 60s? 60s? I don't know.
Hmm. <laughs> it's not Elvis, but. Ew. Gross. So is this a, is this an old song or is it newer? Yeah, it's a little older. Um, I want to say it's Meatloaf. Did Meatloaf die? Not meatloaf. So, unless meatloaf is two words, it is two words. Paradise by the dashboard light. Let's do it. Is that it? It was it. I don't know why. I don't know why you knew that, but um, okay. <coughs> that is a very pointy. Okay. You. Yeah, I mean, it definitely sticks out for me. I know what Ethiopia yeah, it's looks. Just a fucking point yeah we're four for four i don't know does your dad listen to meatloaf why the fuck do you know meatloaf I've, i have heard that song and i don't remember a hundred percent i think it was like in fifth grade my music teacher used to play the shit out of that and then he'd let us play ddr in the in the shit in the trailer some people have life experiences that sound like they're good and that's not one of them yeah you played dance right. dance revolution in a trailer while listening to meatloaf did he also fucking touch your piggy hole? Like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> nah, dude. We used to listen to that Sean Paul song. Dance uh, to it. Temperature? Yeah, yes. Oh, I got a lot of right that takes to turn you on. And girl, I should have been listening to Sean Kingston, honestly. Yeah, I don't think he was, like, alive yet. I think so. What do you mean? <laughs> Those songs were literally out at, like, the same time. What are you talking about? We might need to do is some... Is he that old? Sean Kingston. Yeah, dude. Nah, dude. He's he's not that old. You're fucking lying. I think, I think he's the same age as us. Yeah, but he came out with a song when he was like 18. He's 32. Um, 2007 to 2008. Okay. Beautiful Girls came out in 2007. Holy shit. That's kind of close. What the hell? Yeah, because you, you'd be in middle school in 2007. Yeah, we're getting old. I don't, <laughs> I don't like that. Oh, Where's... Yeah, uh, Temperature came out between 2005 and 2008. Uh, temperature 2006. So literally a year before. <laughs> you do not have the right, 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 right tactics to turn me on, bro. Uh, National League outfielder, probably. Um, easy. It's not that easy. He's classified as a DH. Man plays the outfield, okay? Um, yeah. Oh, he's right-handed. I was going to say Nimmo. Uh, based upon this, yes. Uh, so, NL East, probably? Pete Alonzo. Oh, he's not an outfielder, so I don't even know why I'd say that. Um, okay, National League East, young outfielder that plays left field right-handed. Um, so, we got Mets, Marlins. Nationals, Marlins. Jesus Sanchez? Sure, let's do that. No, he's left-handed, and it's U.S. It's USA, so um, so that leaves us with the Nationals, the Mets, the Mets. Who is an outfielder for the Mets? Uh, McNeil, uh, Nimmo is left-handed. Yeah, he's left field. He played like second base or some shit. McNeil? Yeah, he plays. He's a super utility. He plays second outfield. All that. Okay. Um. Yeah. Nimmo, who's their other outfielder out there? Didn't they sign somebody from... Okay, what's the last team? Because there's five, right? Because there's 30 teams, 5, 10, 15. So we're missing... We have the Mets, we have the Nationals, and then... The Phillies. The Phillies. Okay, so you got Schwarby. Oh, oh God. He's left-handed. Uh Uh, oh, it's God. not Matt Veerling. Okay, so it's either 23 or 26. Um, okay. And he plays for the Mets or 
the Nats. Yeah. Um, let's see. Who do the Nats have out there other than Shorty. Juan Soto? No, the, he's with Philadelphia. Oh, yeah. Shit, that's right. Um, Soto? Oh, uh, is it that kid I hate? What's his name? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Robles. Yeah, but he's a center fielder, so I don't think he'll be in here. All right, yeah, okay. So, white dude who plays left field for Washington. Washington. I assume he's a white dude. That could be wrong. Like, totally wrong. Um, I should just say American dude. Robles, I should have probably guessed was not American. Um, They got... Uh, so, it's not Soto. He does play left field, Yadiel Hernandez, but he's Cuban, so... No, Soto is left-handed, and he plays right. Um, so we're looking for another left fielder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell? Um, they have Nelson Cruz. They got Josh Bell. Um, Does Nelson Cruz play the outfield? I don't want to see no. that man play uh, I mean, he did 15, 10 years ago. He hasn't played in a long time. Uh, with Texas, he definitely played, like, right field. Um I'm drawing some blanks here, my man. He's got to be like a piss player, right? Or are we just missing somebody? Uh, I'm trying to think of their lineup. It's Soto, Cruz, Bell, right? Or Soto, Bell, Cruz. Robles bats ninth. Mikel Franco's like seventh. You have uh, Alcides Escobar playing second base. Where's their shortstop? I don't even know. Some rando? But, mm. So this guy has to be, like, leading off almost. Shortstop. You already said Cesar Hernandez, right? Because I know he's there. Oh, he... Is he... Yeah, he is there. Then does Elcides Escalera play short? Because he's like a starter. He's just been hurt. That sounds right. Um, uh, so, okay, I guess Cesar Hernandez probably leads off. So this is like, and then the eighth hitter is probably the catcher. So he's like the sixth hitter probably in the lineup. <laughs> um, that doesn't really help. Um It's got to be like a nobody, just a straight nobody. Um, if it's a somebody, then that's not good. I have dementia then. I, don't well, know. I mean, I'm drawing blanks too. Freddie Freeman, Adam Wainwright. Okay, it is Lane Thomas. Who the hell is Lane Thomas? He, he, some people picked him to be good this year. Okay, we missed one. So we got Wordle, Hurdle, Framed, and Wordle. So we have four out of five. So we just need one more. Easy peasy. A.J. Brown, K, not A.J. Brown. So it's going to be an offensive player at the AFC, probably a run, uh, quarterback, maybe. Ooh, Justy Herbie. Yep, quarterback. AFC South. And he's young. Okay, he's in the AFC East. That leaves us with Zach Wilson. Yep, that, that's about right. All right, so Ladies we got hide your mom's. five out of six. Or don't. That's up to you. All right, we're a defensive player in the AFC. Taller than six foot one. Uh, These are the ones where we need Ryan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is undeniably true. I don't know who CJ... I was going to say CJ Mosley. I feel like all my players I used to use all the time are just not in the league anymore. So... Yeah. So he wears yeah. the number seven or eight. And he's probably a linebacker uh, based on the height. No. Well, not sorry, not a linebacker, but a defensive end or some shit. Uh, I don't think so. I think he's like a safety. Who's the... Uh, uh, okay. He's not a safety, but he's like 30 or 29. So he's an AFC West or East. Um we go to the classic Asante Samuel Jr. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. No. He's a kicker or, or, a, or a punter because he's not – he's – okay. So 
Do oh, we? Gross. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. That's why he's seven. That's why he's seven or eight. So, uh, do we oh know any of the? McManus, isn't he with Denver? Yeah, I was already oh typing God, it in. It. Yeah. yeah, six of seven. Fucking gross! They tried to do you dirty, bro. Yeah, I was. I uh, had to pay attention there. This guy looks like Chase Buttinger. You know who Chase Buttinger is, Colin? I don't. He was a basketball player for Arizona, and you know what he did after he quit basketball? He only played basketball for a couple of years. He became a professional beach volleyball player. Could you? T- could could I just want to be good at one thing? And then these motherfuckers out here are doing thirty fucking things. Actually, is this Tyler Hero? Hey, hair. Looks very Tyler Hero esque. It is. Oh. Oh my God! Get nothing. People bashing <laughs> me for that poor tattoo he got. Oh, I God. I didn't see the tattoo. Maybe you can. It's bad. Tell me it's about bad. it later. Uh. Who did Chet Hol- yeah. Who did he get drafted by? Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. See. He's yeah, he had, he is not he has no height. Um nope. so he's probably he's which is kind of which is kind of fucked up because that doesn't give us any help. Also <laughs> OKC know. is in the north. Oh yeah, that's right. Seattle. I forget. Yeah. I always get mad about that. Um Okay. So let's just think of a team in Pacific uh that has like a w- white dude. I think this is a white dude, right? With a beard? Yeah, kind of looks like Maybe it. Maybe we just do like... Uh, he, he doesn't have hair like that, but... That's the... Okay, but he's a center, 6'11", 25 or 26. Um, Be a younger fella. Says what is he with the Knicks? I was just playing with the Clippers and the fucking... Hmm. Hmm. the jazz have like some tall center white dude so is he in the pacific division then pacific or um well let's narrow it down i guess pacific is all the cali teams and Uh the suns he used to play with the spurs at one point he is 26 and his numbers between 25 and 55 he is in the pacific division okay uh, I keep on going to Yusuf Nurkic in my head, but that's Northwest. Uh, 26. So that's, um, Golden State, Clippers. Yeah, that's all the Kelly teams. Who, who's the, uh, who's the center for the Clippers? It's a, it's a white dude, I'm pretty sure. Uh... Okay, it's not the Clippers. Okay. A Russian dude, I think, for the Clippers. Doesn't matter. We've moved on. We were wrong. I was yeah, wrong. I know, but I don't remember the name. I don't think so. Uh, I don't think it's Golden State. Um, no, and I don't really think it's the Lakers either. Okay, so that leaves us with one team, which is the Kings. Gross. Sabonis? Uh, he's with. Uh, he's not a center, right? Yeah. Okay. But the, everything else is correct. <coughs> uh, so it is one of the teams we eliminated, which would be the Lakers, Lakers. the Warriors, or who's the last one? The uh, Suns. Uh, yeah. It's probably the Suns. They got Dario Saric and some other white dude. I'm just going to put... Luker. <laughs> Chris Paul. I know they have... Jock Landale? What the oh, hell the... is that? Is that Jock Peterson's brother? J-O-C versus J-O-K? I have no idea who that individual is. Well, we got six out of eight. Let's he, see. What, what... He, oh, yeah. He plays for Phoenix. What the hell? I like this ad. I don't know what's going on here, but let's see what I would have had to have done if I didn't get it correct. Ooh. 
No matter what you said, I'd have to agree. Damn. That would have been a good one. And it's kind of like totally free. All right. Uh, that was uh, it for today. We got six out of eight. And uh, some good guesses there. Colin apparently loves meatloaf. We learned that today. Um, if you have something to say, if you enjoyed the content, X, Y, Z, uh, leave a comment, like, comment, and subscribe. We're starting to get views a little bit back up again after our hiatus. Slowly but surely, we're making our way back up. So we appreciate all of you for being here uh, and enjoying the content. We will see you next time. Uh, please watch the reference video that will be uh, uploaded with this as well. That'll be super sweet. Deuces.